Good morning. It is Saturday morning and I have been out running errands and doing a little shopping. What do I have here, you wonder? It's not a diamond painting, <laughs> but let me show you what I got. I stopped at Hobby Lobby because I was looking for some of their diamond dot slash leisure art Christmas paintings, hoping some had come in. We'll talk about that in a minute. I walked in the front door, though, and this guy was sitting. He's got a big glob of glue there. We'll have to fix that. This guy was sitting in the front on one of their little tables, and I was like, <gasps> have to get him. Have to, have to get him. Look at him. He's so cool. Look, he's got a little bird right here, and he's got his staff. He's all furry. He's so cool. So I have a Santa collection. Yep, I do. Um, and he's my new one for this year. I walked in, made my purchase. I was walking out, and I saw him sitting there again, and I was like, nope. Pick him up, turn around, go buy him, because you're going to kick yourself right in the butt if you go back later and you can't find him. So there he is. 40% off. I try to get the 40% off whenever I can. And you can always get a coupon. Just look up Hobby Lobby. They always have a coupon on their website, 40% off. I didn't need it for him. He was already 40% off. But I'll show you my Santa collection when we get um, towards Christmas. Now, I know a lot of you are so into this Halloween thing. And Halloween's not my... My thing, it just isn't. I prefer Christmas. Christmas is my holiday of choice. But anyhow, when I was at Hobby Lobby, I went in specifically looking for Christmas leisure art paintings I'd seen on their website. And I didn't find them. They, they have a large aisle now. A quarter of the aisle probably is paintings. They've got magnets. They've got bracelets. They've got small little... They've got, they've got a good selection. But I didn't see any Christmas, and I was disappointed. I was leaving the aisle, and I saw this woman with this huge box. And I was like, that's a diamond painting. What does she have? It's a nativity scene. It was an $80 painting, a nativity scene. Partial drill, huge thing. And she was, like, talking to her friends about it. Like, what is this? And I don't know. Maybe you do this. Maybe it's like, I'm like, okay. PSA, public service announcement time. Sat and talked to them for about five to ten minutes about diamond painting. Shared my channel, of course, shameless plug, right? But <laughs> talked to them about diamond painting and explained it kind of what, you know. Anyhow, I, I helped them out a little bit. And then I realized she got that nativity scene off an end cap where they had yet more diamond paintings. And that's where they had the Christmas ones. So, anyhow, let me show you what else I have at Hobby Lobby. These were 50% off. I always pick these up when I see them. It's a frame with glass in a good size that we can put a diamond painting in. Maybe you got to put a little trim around the outside or, you know, we'll see what fits in it. I won't use this at all, but the glass, I loved the rustic wood. Love that part. I pick these up whenever I see something I think is going to work that's a good size. I just try to pick them up. 50% off. You can't beat it. Cost me like eight bucks. All right. Okay. Um, on the way in the door, I thought, well, all of the fall stuff is on clearance or really like, you know, 40%, 50% off, something like that. And I had picked up some uh, fall paintings. There was a turkey and a scarecrow. And I thought, well, let me go, go see in the little kid craft what they have. Well, they had Halloween ones. They have a pumpkin and pumpkin and a cat. These are so cute. I opened one of these up at school the other day because I'm definitely taking these to school. And these are going to be something like some of the kids who've done a really nice job for the week as a little special treat can get to do these. They're stickers. Okay, they're bigger stickers than you get in some of the little sticker, you know, packages. But look at them. They're super cute. Look at those little stickers. I think they're stickers. Maybe these aren't stickers. No, they're stickers. They're stickers. So there's your two stickers. Here's your little kit. You get the little round tray with these. Okay. I have one of these at school I'm using. I'm not crazy about it. It doesn't help flip the drills over very well. But you get a little round tray. And here's your little gems. Look. There's like five colors here or something. 
white, green, black, pink, orange, and purple. There you go. What more do you need for Halloween, right? Cute. So I got I got two sets, and they were forty percent off. Two sets of those. Yeah. Why not? I'll let the kids at school do those. That'll be fun. They know about my channel. We watched a video. You know, they're excited about it. They want to know when they can do it. <laughs> and the video I showed them just the other day, one of the little boys kept saying, is it done? Did you do it? I'm like, no, I just got it. I just took it out of the box. No. <laughs> so before I show you what I did get, I had to go to the post office on my way home and send off the carousel box. The carousel box is on its way to the first recipient. How exciting. And the lady were talking about what's in it, blah, 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 as I was shipping. And of course, diamond painting came up. And she's like, what is that? Again, a PSA. Twice in one day. And she was very excited to hear about it. And then, of course, plug my channel again. She wrote it down and everything. She's going to go check it out and see what it is. So, yeah. Anyhow, um, here were some of the pictures I saw them advertising. The Leisure Arts, Diamond Art. I was really looking for this one. I saw somebody, I think Abstract Crafter, I think, got this one. And she was wondering if this one's a painting. Yes, it is. So is this. This comes in a painting also. Who knows? That could be a painting on a pillow, but I don't know. Um, but I saw that on their channel as well. Not their channel, like their website. I think I started seeing them on Instagram, I think. So it tells you what's in here. Okay, this one happens to be a full drill. It says it has 13 facet gems. 13 facets on their gems? Okay, all right. So this one is really pretty. Let me show you what I got. Oh, it's all taped up. All right, here we go. Well, it's protected, right? Okay. Let me show you the picture. It is... Oh, dang it, there goes my phone. I am sorry, you guys are going to hear that. I forgot to mute my ringer. Here's the picture. All right. And I'm going to pause, and I'll come back in just a second, because I'm going to go mute that ringer so it doesn't do that again. Hang on. All right, we should be good now. No ringing noises in my video. I'm getting tired of that. <laughs> Anyhow. I love this. This little lantern is so pretty. It's a full drill, so the entire canvas is drilled. So let's see what it looks like. Here's our gems, and I'm assuming our toolkit is in that as well. So let's look at that first. They had a Santa. A Santa was big. I was surprised how big the Santa was. Santa. Um, that nativity scene was giant, just giant. I don't even know the size. I didn't look at it, but it was big. And then they had a snowman. I love the snowman. The only reason I didn't get it is because that was the very first Diamond Dots I ever did was snowman and his little friends. And I kind of have done the snowman thing with Diamond Dots, but it's really cute. So they do a nice little kit. Here's your pen. I love their wax that it comes in this tin. I still have my first little container. A squishy for your pen, your boat, and some baggies. They do a nice little kit. All right? You can't complain about that little kit. All right, so there's that. Let's just do our gems first since I got them out here. Um, there's a lot. Wow, there's a lot of colors in this. In this case, there's yellow, orange, now, Diamond Dots does not have DMC codes. Diamond Dots has their own number coding system. I suppose if you wanted to keep track of your Diamond Dots, you could start matching up these numbers that they put on it, but I I have enough drills that I try to store away that I don't want to do anymore, right? So, some blues. Isn't those pretty? Deep blue. This is, that's blue. It's not really black. There's blue in it. And some browns. And like a mulberry color. And then we have one more strip. Which has a purple. This is a really like Pepto-Bismol pink. <laughs> Light blue. 
That's a green. Minty green. A lot of this yellowy color. And then there's an AB. Diamond Dots is really good about AB. It's white AB. Of course, it's a Christmassy scene. Why wouldn't we have white ABs, right? All right, so there's our drills. There's a lot of them. I don't even know how many that is. It's a lot. 29, according to the box. There's 29 dazzling gems. And how do I get into this bad boy? I don't know. No clue. I really don't know. Okay, way right down here. There we go. Woo! That's a little struggle. Okay, this canvas is a little different than um, a diamond dot that I got before. This one is not soft. Most of the diamond dots that I've gotten are soft, you know, kind of like a Timney Arts, Diamond Art Club kind of feeling, belty, softer canvas. This one is not. This one is um, more of a, I don't know what you can call it. It's not soft, though, but it's a nice canvas. It's still scalloped and a little surging to keep it from fraying. I don't think it's going to fray at all, so it looks good. It's just different. It's rolled really tight, all right, really, really tight. And here's our directions. Diamond Dots is known for giving you these massive directions. Sometimes they give you like a whole booklet. So here's directions on how to diamond paint. So that's in there. So let me see. This is poured glue, so I don't have to worry about that. Let's see if I can just fold it or roll it backwards a little bit to get it to lay a little flatter. I'm not really rolling it. Look, I'm just kind of folding it so it will lay down for us. It says the design size is a 12 by 12. So the design itself will come out 12 by 12 inches. The fabric is 15 by 15. So it's going to be a nice 12 by 12 when it's done. It will fit right in a 12 by 12 frame. Dollar Tree, you can get those for a dollar. So here it shows the dazzle area, and you can tell from the picture that the whole thing is dazzled. If it is a partial, it will show you what part is dazzled compared to what's not. But this one is a full drill. So there it is. Love their symbols. Their symbols are so nice. They're so easy to read. So here they are. There's some of their symbols. They're super easy, super simple to read. And they have a key on the left, even on this small painting. There's a key over here on the left, another one over here on the right. So no matter which way you have this facing, you're going to be able to see your, your symbol list. And there's 29 colors in this small painting. That is pretty good for a 12 by 12. But look at it. Isn't it pretty? It's a little lantern. Oh, you can't see it. It's just a little lantern with some Christmas greenery and balls and the light and some snowflake effects up here. Super pretty. I love it. I don't have anything like that. I love lanterns, though. I have lanterns all over my, on my decorations outside on my porch and down by the pond. I do a lot of lantern type things. I loved it. It's pretty. Okay, let's go get really close and let's look at the symbols. Clarity. I love their symbols. Diamond Dots just does a nice job. You cannot really find any fault with Diamond Dots. They're a good company. They do a good little kit. Lots of confetti here. But then we got a whole bunch of color blocking up in here and some in here. So this is Really confetti heavy in here. Even the little balls are like three. See, look at that. They're like three different symbols, four maybe. So it's a lot of confetti. But it's going to be really, really pretty. Look at it. Super pretty. I like it. It's going to be so nice. So, you know, if you've got a Hobby Lobby near you, check them out, you guys. They, My Hobby Lobby is just getting more and more diamond painting stuff all the time, and I love it. They're all diamond art, which is Powered by Diamond Dots, Leisure Arts, Diamond Art, it's all Diamond Dots, right? So check them out. They do a really nice job. So there you have it. I got some Christmas going. Got a little Halloween going. Got my Santa dude over here. There's my Santa. I love him. Ho, ho, ho. I love Christmas. I love Christmas. So anyhow, I'm a little ahead of the game on that one. <laughs> but I didn't want to miss out. You know, the second I walked out and left him there, I'd go back, he'd be gone. So anyhow, there you go, guys. Just my little Saturday morning shopping trip. So thanks for watching. 
Thanks for hitting the like button and subscribing and all that stuff and helping my channel grow. Um, maybe someday this will be my full-time job and I can do this all the time. So that's my goal. Anyhow, thanks for watching, you guys, and I will see you in the next video.